Hey everyone, welcome to a XCOM 2 video. Just check everyone, everything is set up nicely. Check. So, I have played a small portion of this game. Not a lot, but I've played some. This is a uh, free to play with Games of Gold now for four days, and I thought I'd hop on and see how what I got. Excitement continues to build as citizens success. across the globe prepare for the 20th anniversary of Unification Day. Thousands line up at the site of the Great Accord, celebrating the formation of the Advent Coalition. Keeping with their promise to humanity, 12 new gene therapy clinics will be opening in select cities by the end of the new year. Despite the attempted attack by fringe elements, operations at the new facility in Paris thankfully remain unaffected. In response to the unprovoked intrusion on the eve of our most beloved celebration, the speaker reaches out to us. A small number of dissidents again repeat the mistakes of the old world. Striking as we celebrate the benevolent savior who time and again offers only friendship and compassion. Yet these trivial actions could never break the bond between humanity and the elders. Keeping forces have already made several preemptive arrests of known collaborators. Advent again assures all citizens that today's celebrations will continue as planned. Perfect. The Advent administration reminds you to report all suspicious activity to your position. You were right. Definitely got their hands full today. Stay focused. Prep gate crasher. 60 seconds. This isn't like a first person shooter kind of game. It's more of a strategic uh, movement sort of game. So you will like the characters like this, and you have to move the characters to something. Let's go to Tamax. Grab some cover near that low wall. Copy that. Moving up. So you select your character, and you move him to here. So your basic aim is to move your people into cover and move further up and Crasher two, stay close. Keep pace with Crasher one. But then at some point Double like time. enemies will come 
and then you have to use your moves wisely because you have a certain number of moves like this actually kill people I'm gonna get supported doing this though. Maybe not. Don't get too close. They'll be spotted for sure and we'll lose our advantage. Okay, so the game's just telling me what to do. It's not a boy. They may have the numbers, but we've got surprise on our side. Hopefully that's enough. Also, the enemy has to also move in like different sequences, so they can't just like full on shoot, you know. So, they can see you now. How about you all shoot first and celebrate later? No problem. I appreciate the bravery, but you're dangerously close right now. Be careful. You just told me to move there. So he tells me she's not dead. She's calling reinforcements. Stop that. Transmission. Central reporting in. Oh, yeah. You're late. What have you been doing down there? Taking in the sights. What the hell are these things? They're us. At least there used to be. Human hybrid soldiers. Advent's reward for obedience and service. We've all heard rumors. I just never believed it was true. No one wanted to. 
But we find what we're looking for today. I promise you that's gonna change. Let's move. Hmm. Looks like that transmission went through. You have an advent transport closing on your position. You heard her. Cover the left side. Right, so let's move. You're fine, cover. Don't you want me to move over, move over? Right? I'm on it. What about those two? Keep your eyes peeled. Fire on anything that moves. Where do you want me to move him now? Oh, yeah. The main entrance is clear. We need to move on the package. Dokey. He's over the jet, which means he'll shoot or whatever, like he can. Well done. Fall back to our position. Just go. I'll try to stall him here. I feel like him. I don't want this guy to die because I killed the lady. She's there as well. Do I have to do? Let's 
What about the other dude? Throw the grenade. Here. Fire in the hole. Like a really weird, like, perspective sort Works of thing. This guy. We're coming home. Oh yeah, yeah. That doesn't make sense. That makes sense. say that. But I don't like it. It's too all over the place, you know. Like it's cool. I don't like it. It's weird and 
sure about it. I don't really know what's going on. Carefully! There's potentially decades of atrophy to contend with. Wish we had more time. I don't disagree. But as it stands now, we risk losing the patient if we don't begin the removal procedure immediately. We are ready. Good. Then let's get on with it. Remarkable. Just like 20 years ago. We were still calling it a war back then. coming response from the cerebral cortex good prepping for cranial intrusion i've managed to identify the connection preparing to make final incision these readings are getting really erratic of course they are these implants were never designed to be removed we are risking severe... No plan B here, people. Do it. Response normal, vital stabilizing, procedure complete. Told them it would take more than that to keep you down. Welcome back, Commander. What's the commander look like? Hmm. I think this is going to do for this episode, but I'm going to let you watch the cutscene. finally coming out of it. Don't envy the headache you must have, though. Still. Can't fault Dr. Tigan. Especially as no one's even attempted something like this before. Easy. We're still not entirely sure what they did to you. That chip was buried halfway into your skull. Lost a lot of good soldiers looking for you over the years. Almost gave up hope you were still out there. Acted on the intel as soon as I got word. Not sure what you remember, but... Uh... A lot's changed. Did the best I could, but the last 20 years have been tough without you. You uh, feel like catching up. Shen has the archive up and running on your terminal. Otherwise, I'd go see Dr. Tigan when you're ready. There's some things you should know. He'll be better at explaining them than me. It's damn good to have you back, Commander. Weird how they say commander. It's gonna be a first person. Commander to the research labs. Impressive, isn't it? Capable of generating immense power, yet completely harmless to human life. If only the same could be said for the rest of the aliens' technology, Commander. Dr. Richard Tigan, Chief Science Officer. I am responsible for the entirety of our research here, as well as the procedure you so recently underwent. Welcome to my lab, such as it is. I'm not sure what Central may have told you, but we found something while removing you from the alien stasis suit. A device implanted directly in your occipital lobe. Had I access to the equipment available to me during my tenure at Advent, I would already know the precise nature of its function. However, given time and your approval, of course, Commander, I assure you, I will find out. Which brings to light an additional point. Though aspects of this facility are indeed impressive, I am but one man. Were you to direct additional support personnel and resources to me, I could substantially improve the speed of all our research. A farewell, Commander. On your order, Commander. I will begin researching the Advent chip for possible insights as to its function. 
I'll see that work begins immediately, Commander. I'll contact you when I have a full report available. That research will keep Tigan busy for a while. In the meantime, you might want to head down to the armory. Commander, Jane Kelly was instrumental in the op to get you back. She earned enough experience for a promotion. We should take care of that now. The Ranger serves as our primary reconnaissance unit, capable of moving independently in concealment while engaging enemies at close range. Concealed. I can see it. We're off to a good start. Our troops will yes. only get stronger as they gain experience. Come to the bridge. We're in a big ship. Yep. I'm in the bridge. Like. I heard you, Shen. When we get the thing, you'll be the first to know. Attention. Unauthorized presence detected. Commander. Give me a second. Execute Echelon Protocol. Attention. Senior command exchange confirmed. I had wanted that to be a little more ceremonious, but we've got something. A local resistance cell just located this hybrid magnetic power converter that Shen's been pushing us to find. They tracked the device to a nearby advent convoy and are attempting... If we can bring this converter back in one piece, we might actually get this place up and running and give the aliens a real war for a change. The squad is prepped and ready to launch on your order, Commander. Just give the word. Okay, so... You're gonna put me in this mic. Hello, oh, sorry. Anyway, I, that is gonna have to do for this episode of XCOM 2. I, d I don't know if I like the game. It's good. I don't know if I like it. Anyway, I hope you did enjoy me playing the game. Like, a little bit. And I guess I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I hope you guys did enjoy. You would like if you want to like. You would like if you want to see more. And comment if you want to see more. Me playing this game, I'm happy to do so. Maybe I'll start liking it. But it's only for four days. So I might get it if you want to see more. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one.